Good morning, everyone. This is Mitzi with the Miss Misadventures of Mitzi and Short Mitz Adventures. And I'm in my van for the first night. As you can see, my middle seats are gone. It's 4.13 a.m. I gotta work on uh, my sleep habits. Because <laughs> uh, I've been waking up every hour on the hour, just about. And uh, it's pretty comfortable. It, it, we had a rain storm come through the edge of town today. So, oh, I just noticed he took that thing off the front. Uh, huh. Ah, they're still working on, <laughs> on the uh, engine. Or not the engine, but, you know, still working on it. But uh, I told him I was moving in today. I guess he forgot. I came over here, and the doghouse was off, and you could see the whole engine up there, and you could see down to the ground. And I thought, oh, he's nowhere near done. <laughs> and uh, actually, he's pretty close to done now. He couldn't get the head. He's trying to replace the, uh, what did he call it? The gasket, I don't remember the gasket cover or some such thing, and uh, spent a bunch of money today, my first day of the month for me. I just got my money today, and I spent 300 and something like $387 because it was $245 to get my tags and title transferred and that's going up I'm told next year Ugh. and um, then I spent a hundred and something at the car place to get some parts that we hadn't gotten yet but it's had an oil change it's I've got a list somewhere of everything that's been done to it uh, he took out the middle seats, and all he had left is this here, uh, whatever the heck you would call that. Uh, two of those, one for each seat. He said he has to saw it off or grind it off or something, which just surprises me. I figured you just un unbolt it somewhere, but he said he has to saw it off. So he's going to cut that down, but with those seats out, I can't get over how much room is in here. I've got all sorts of room in here, so that's going to be nice. If my neighbors are up, they're going to wonder where the light's coming from inside my vehicle, but I don't care. I'm in my vehicle. And there's my wonderful windows. Um, it's pretty comfortable. A storm came through, like I said, and... Uh, my little screens, I opened all the screens, so, um, nice cross breeze I could feel. Uh, right now I'm, I put my mattress on top of the bench seat that was in here already. And, uh, obviously my mattress is much shorter than the bench seat, and it keeps wanting to slide off. <laughs> but, uh. It, you have to squeeze it, but it does fit from there to there. It squoze in, and I guess I could, I could, uh, lay like this, but I don't want to. There's not a whole lot of room. But on the other hand, I really like all this room it gives me if I do lay back here all this room I can do all kinds of stuff there and how, whatever kind of build I'm gonna put in I'm gonna leave it to where I can get to these screens because that cross breeze is gonna be important for me I do believe except in the winter of course but in the fall and spring that's gonna be really nice to be able to open those screens I know some people totally cover the some of them, but I don't want to do that. So we'll see how that goes when we come to it. And, uh, yeah, I gotta get myself somehow some kind of a 
be able to sleep. I thought I'd sleep like a baby because uh, I only got about four hours sleep last night because I was excited about today. Four hours sleep. And then I came out here around, I don't know, around midnight. Next time I checked the clock, it was 1.30. Next time I checked, it was 2.30 and then 3.30 and now 4.15. So... I'm lightly sleeping, but uh, a lot of that was not sleeping at all. I've got that, uh, uh, what do you call it, uh, um, unhappy leg syndrome. I can't remember what it's called, but I mean, I was constantly doing this, you know, because uh, I have that. Whatever that is. My son has it. He told me the name of it, but I can't remember. But that's the other thing I don't like about laying like this because it is so close. close, close. I kept kidding, kicking the little blinds. I'm afraid I'm going to kick out the screen or something or mess it up somehow. But So I slept at kind of an angle. And like I said, it keeps wanting to slide off <laughs> the bench. So that makes it uncomfortable. But oh, I'm, I feel so, I feel so good knowing that I'm in this thing. And I don't care if he's got stuff to do. I don't care if there's junk everywhere right now. Uh, we're working on it. I did buy one thing that wasn't on his list, but it was on mine. And that is, um, you know, one of these, uh, lighter things. He says these work. So I suppose I could use that to charge my phone. I haven't tried it out yet. But I need one up there. And right now up there there's no no radio and there's no lighter socket to plug in to charge my phone or anything else. So we gotta fix that. And I bought at the auto place I bought one of those uh, things, it's it's about this long, and it's got a big old hole, and it's a lighter thing. And uh, you hook it up to the battery somehow. So, we're going to get that in here tomorrow. I haven't driven it yet because he's got, he's having trouble getting that gasket thing off and putting it, to put the new one on. He said there's all kinds of stuff in the way. And I still have things that need to be done. One of them, he says, I'm going to have to take it into a shop because he's not comfortable doing it. So, you know, I've still got money to spend to fix it. But after tomorrow, it will be drivable. And he started it up, and it sounds nice. There's no uh, whistle or whirl or whatever you call it, whine like there was before. I don't know if the AC is working. I think he said I need to uh, put some, oh, what do you call it, Freon. It needs a Freon boost or R12 or something. Um, but the windows go down, kind of. <laughs> so it's drivable. <laughs> I love it. It's old, but I just love it. I don't care. We'll work with it. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and cut this off for now. And uh, I know you got a great view here. I'm going to do some more tomorrow once it's uh, kind of cleaned up a little bit. And I'm going to get some stuff in here. What I'm thinking is I, I should put a wall up there behind the driver's seat since it doesn't swivel anyway. And I'm going to have a curtain going across. And I'm going to have a curtain going across there. And these things are great. That is going to be great for hanging my clothes when I get my temp job. Because I'm going to have to have some clothes, a place to hang my clothes. But, uh, yeah, I'm happy. I'm real content. Now, if only I could sleep. <laughs> I'm going to try again when I turn this off. But, uh, you know, I wanted to give you an update. Here I am, and here's Goliath. No, it's not Goliath. <laughs> What's your name? 
Yeah, I don't know. Gandalf. I don't know. I he, it, it, The longer I'm in it, the more likely it is I'll give it a different name. But right now it's still Gandalf. <laughs> or Goliath or Gertrude or something. I don't know. But we'll come up with something. <laughs> hey, uh, oy vey. Okay, I love you all. Have a wonderful day or morning. I am tired. So maybe I can go s sleep after I do this. <sighs> Follow your bliss and be nice. Talk to you later. Bye.